Castle in Luton. Hardy Hardy welcoming new owner Romanov and chief exec Fedotovas to Tynecastle with all eyes on another Lithuanian, Mikulunas, who's a welcome addition to an ever evolving hard side. Kelly also adopting a 4 4 2 and being one point adrift of Motherwell before the match, hoping a win here would leapfrog them into the top six. Referee for this match, John Underhill. Well, there can be no question here of familiarity breeding content, these teams meeting once again after that cup tie next uh, last week and a replay to come in midweek handball and perhaps accidental but uh, given nevertheless a chance now for Mikhail Yunus a oh, brilliant play a terrific goal by Mikhail Yunus and Hearts take the lead Mikulunas cool is personified as he went through there in goalkeeper comb. Oh, what a superb finish that is. It's a tough time coming up perhaps for Kilmarnock. Here's Mikhail Yunus. Should be brim full of confidence now. Delightful ball in, that was Lee Miller. What a chance for Hearts. Very well, so did Simmons. Mikhail Yunus. Good movement there by Nielsen. An own goal by Fowler. Well, the surface again, treacherous for defenders. That was very good movement, though, on the far side from Hart. Excellent play of all the Mikhail Yunus. And then the overlapping Robbie Nielsen. That was a very dangerous ball he played in, and Fowler on his weaker side. Snatching at the attempted clearance. That's Nielsen switching the play to Wallace. The gap opened up for him. Good play by the youngster. Look at Eunice again. Miller's onside. What a chance for Hearts. And once again, appalling defending by Kilmarnock. McAllister to Wallace. That was good play. Wynas takes over and hits a crossbar. Blocked by Miller. <laughs> well, David Lee seemed to misjudge that in flight. Here's Michael Yunus. His pace is important again. Another chance for a tenth on goal. Off the line by Combe, Dennis Wynas with a header. Now just look at the ton of pace here by Michael Yunus going outside and leaving. They check back inside. Good purple shot with the left foot. It fell there to Wynas with a very deliberate header. And Alan Combe did brilliantly in goal for Kilmarnock. Wynas to Miller. Oh, terrific goal by Miller! Wonderful volley by Lee Miller. Dennis Wynas with a pass to Lee Miller. One thought in his mind, a thundering volley, and Cone could do nothing in goal. Much better play from Kilmarnock. Space now for Gary Hay. Gap is opened up for him. Good effort. And the offside flags up against Chris Boyd. Good play again from Wallace. The turn pass came from Mikhail Yunus. It's picked up by Butchell. That's for Miller. And a very good bit of defending there by Gary Hay. It's been a comfortable, comprehensive victory for Hearts. They won with a degree of comfort, which will be disturbing to Kilmarnock. The final score at Tynecastle Hearts 3, Kilmarnock 0.